finally on the board. Finally got one, didn't we? Not too much to write home about. All right, I'm gonna reposition out here. That's a pretty good fish. He inhaled it too. Gotcha. Nice little fish. Chunk. Be fat. Well, <clears throat> only the little ones are eating right now. That guy's been hooked before. Right on that side of the face. Feels like a little bit better one. He's just a fighter, I think. I don't think he's that big. Just a fighter. No, he's pretty good. It choked that thing too. Mm. Pretty good fish there. Might have got a good one there. Oh yeah. Got a horse on the spinner bait. Mm. Oh. Come here. Tank. Got a tank. All right, Let's see if we can weigh this chunk. Looks like it's five pounds, one ounces, five pounds, two ounces, 21, 21 inches. Oh, he's a horse. He fought too. How you doing there? You're good. 
Oh, that was awesome. So that bass went for about five pounds, two ounces. Caught him on this white and chartreuse, half ounce spinner bait. Been throwing quite a few things today. Cinco's up against the banks, a flute, topwater buzz bait, and this spinner bait. Right now I'm throwing this spinner bait on a Lose Classic Speed Spool bait caster reel. The rod I'm using is a Falcon Medium Action 6'6 six six rod. It's a great spinner bait rod. Kind of got perfect conditions for a spinner bait. Got a little breeze, got a little cloud cover. Having a little bit of chop on the water is a good thing for this. Spinner bait is definitely one of my confidence baits. It's a lure that I was kind of forced to pick up. Probably 25 years ago, I was fishing tournaments with a guy. He was a heavy crankbait fisherman. He pounded the banks hard. So I needed to learn how to throw something that would complement a crankbait with something different. And a spinner bait something that you can easily move and keep up with someone on the front throwing a crankbait down riprap or whatever else they're throwing it at. I think that's just a little one. It is. I saw him pop over there on the bank and threw at it and he hit it. Barely had him. Barely had him. Change up to the Yum Dinger. Colors ghillie suit. That was first cast, wasn't it? Gosh dang if he didn't choke it too. Not too bad though. Little guy. I think Mr. Luke just caught one. There he goes with it. It's a nice fish. Nice fish. Mm. Took a run there, didn't he? Choked it too. Yep, nice fish. Gotta get it out of its gullet though. It's three today in the gullet. There we go. It's a nice chunk too. Yeah. Nice fish. Got it safely out of its gullet. Healthy. Let that one go back. Those fish, when they do hit that uh, stick bait, they are choking that sucker. That fish, I don't know what it was, two pounds, two and a half pounds. Man, they're the fighters. So fun. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's a fighter. <clears throat> I think I'm caught up in a tree with it. caught in a tree with it and I can see it down there. Okay. Wait, I just got him. Oh, 
Nice fight. Look at that mama. Woo. Look at that one. Got wrapped up in that tree. It's only three pounds. Hmm. 19 inches, a little over three pounds. Oh, I thought she was bigger than three. Hit that spinner bait. There she goes. Hey, thanks for coming along today with us. Remember to click that like button if you like this kind of content. Please consider subscribing to the channel if you want to see more of this kind of content. Thanks for watching.